Have you ever been on support chat with a company or talking to someone online and you need to show them a screenshot of the issue that you're facing, but the problem is that the support chat doesn't have any way to upload images. This happens a lot with different support chats. Now some do have the way to attach an image, but that's more rare than the ones that don't have any way to share an image. So this is how you share an image with someone over chat with support of a screenshot when they don't offer you the ability to upload it. So what you wanna do is take your screenshot of whatever the issue is, have it ready on your desktop and go to image, so imgbb.com, imgbb.com. This website allows you to upload images to the web and just gives you a link to share it. You're gonna click the big blue button that says start uploading. It's gonna open up a window to choose where the image is located at. So if it's on your desktop, you just select the image, click upload in there. It's gonna upload it. It's gonna give you a landing page with a link, you just copy the link and then you paste that into your chat box and, and send it to them and they can now click on that link and they can view the image that you're talking about. So this is super helpful because screenshots tell so much a better story than we can ever write in words. And sometimes with chat support, they, just, they don't wanna really help you unless you can visually show them exactly what the issue is um, and you just go around and around and around. And so I love using this because it, being able to visually tell, story tell is so important when you're trying to get support for something. And the chat support is sometimes the only way you can get support these days, like on Google. Google got rid of their phone calls and things like that, so it's pretty annoying. The only way to get chat is to go through, or get support, I should say, is to go through chat. So here's a quick way on how to get images into a chat. Just go to imgbb.com, upload the image, and you'll get your little link, and you can send it to chat, and they can check it out. One little tip that I would share, someone else, uh, in one of my TikTok videos had complained about kick, clicking on some of the links on some of these sites. So like imgbb.com, it's a free website, allows you to upload images to the web. Of course they rely on advertising. Don't click any of the ads. Be very, very careful where you click on these websites because who knows what these ads are about or what, what they might do to your, your computer. You just wanna be very careful. You're just gonna click on just the start uploading button. Don't click any of the ads. Sometimes the ads are targeted to what you're doing on the website and try to confuse you or make you think, oh, I need to click here to get started or whatever. Like, don't do that. Just be very careful where you click on the websites. When you go to these free use websites to be able to do something, they're relying on ad revenue in order to offer you a free support of a product like that. So just be very wary that you're not gonna click on an ad and, and you'll be fine. So if you need any more help with this subject about uploading images to the web, that's my expertise as a web developer, I'm always adding images to the web. It's something I do all day, day in, day out. If you need help with your website, definitely contact me, Joe Fiel with Skypoint Studios, and I would love to help you out. Thanks so much for watching my videos, and I'll catch you in the next one.